So you've said something a few times. I'm very interested in drilling down on this. You and I had a long, very interesting discussion last time we chatted about crowdfunding and the differences. So in that context, you've used the word sophisticated, right? So when you sit in front of an inst a sophisticated institutional investor, just describe what that means. I mean, picture yourself in the room, you're raising the next fund, and you are now presenting your case for why they should allocate money to you. What, what does it mean to be sophisticated in that environment? Yeah, I, I think what I, what I mean by sophisticated is the, the investor is very aware of the opportunities that they could invest in. Um, they know the space. They know the risk return spectrum. They know how much leverage they want to take. Um, and they understand the opportunity uh, that you're presenting where they, you know, and I think that um, some of that's based on experience, some of that's based on their team, some of it's based on their, their uh, ability to execute. Some of them are very sophisticated, but they can't execute very quickly. So meaning if you present the deal to some investor, like some of our investors, I could show them a deal. Some people, some of our investors can make a decision on a deal within a week to move forward. There are some that can't make a decision within a month. And so it, I think that that also speaks to um, a little bit of the sophistication of, of how quickly they can move. Um, the other thing is like just sort of understanding uh, the opportunity and how, how, like if you've invested in a region or in a product type and you understand and ask the right questions, you'll all, that'll also come across during a meeting, right? So like if we're meeting with an investor that's never invested, let's say in the United States, then, you know, not that they're not sophisticated, but they're not going to understand the nuances of the U S market if they've never invested here. Just like if you've never invested in Zimbabwe, like you won't understand that market as well. So it's, it's sort of give and take, but they may understand their home market really well. And I think that that's sort of a, a key difference.